We live in a world where binge watching on Netflix is the norm, and instant gratification has become commonplace. So you might think that when it comes to subscription services, getting as much as possible as quickly as possible is better for everyone. But with membership sites, sometimes slowing things down can actually benefit both your members, who may not want or need everything all at once, and benefit yourself by making users more committed to visiting your site. In this video, I'll go over why releasing content at a slower pace, or dripping, may be a good thing for your site, and how setting it up is simple with MemberPress. Before we begin, if you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell for all of our latest updates, tips, and tricks to help you get up and running with MemberPress. Now, let's jump in. Having access to everything all at once can be overwhelming and sometimes leave your members feeling like they're drinking out of a fire hose. Content dripping is the process of releasing content in batches, like over the course of a few months, or however frequent you want to make new information available. This makes your content more manageable and digestible. Providing content gets users to your site. Dripping content keeps them there. Since all your content isn't available at once, they need to come back for more, and that means higher engagement with you. It can allow you to release content on a regular basis without having the pressure to constantly create brand new, engaging material. You could have a year's worth of content prepared in advance and slowly drip it out to your members. For a monthly membership site, content dripping can prevent people from signing up for your site, getting all your content right away, and never returning. Or worse, signing up, getting all your content, and then asking for a refund. Let's say you publish a course. It's designed to take 20 hours over a five week period, but someone sits down and completes the whole course in two days. Since they're done, they no longer come back to your site. That can hurt business. If they have to take the course over time, however, they'll need to visit your site multiple times. This gives you more views, more opportunities to advertise, and more chances to engage with the user. Dripping can make learning feel less daunting and overwhelming, which is the last thing you want. When it comes to your online courses, if you offer small assignments over time, your material can be easier to comprehend than if the entire course is available all at once. The user is given a chance to submit their quizzes and other assignments before they move on in the material. The content drip technique is also a powerful way to hook your audience. Even making a user provide an email before being allowed to see more of your site could be considered content dripping. A user is likely to come back because they've invested their time, or at least their email. You could also drip specific menu items or posts, requiring a user to view them in a certain order. They can progress at their own pace, but you control the user's experience by requiring them to view the content in order from top to bottom. So now I'm gonna go into MemberPress to show you how you can easily drip content on your site. For this example, I have my sample gardening membership site set up with three pages that I want to only be available to paying members of my site. The user will get one when they sign up for a membership, and then one page will be released to them every week after sign up. MemberPress allows you to drip content with a simple feature found in each of your rules, which you can set up to protect your content. The MemberPress drip feature can be applied to any rule that you have, meaning that you can drip anything that can be protected by a MemberPress rule. So I'll go to MemberPress, Rules, and Add New. Under Protected Content, I'm going to select Single Page from the dropdown and select my first page, Gardening 101. Under Access Conditions, I'll select my premium membership. Right now, this rule makes it so someone must have my premium membership to view this page. As soon as someone signs up for my premium membership, they'll gain access to this page instantly. Now, for my next page, I'll create a new single page rule set to my premium membership. Next, I want to set up my drip feature. Under Drip Expiration, I'll check Enable Drip. Here, I have various options to set my drip for any number of days, weeks, months, or years in this dropdown. And here in the second dropdown, you'll select after what event the drip will be triggered. I'm going to select Member Purchases Premium and set it for one week. This will release this post one week after someone signs up for my premium membership. While we're here, you'll notice another option under Enable Drip, and that's Enable Expiration. This feature will let your content expire after a specified time period after a certain action. This can be used with or without drip enabled as well. For example, if I want to drip a post to a user one week after they've purchased my membership, but only make it accessible for 30 days, I can set to expire this content 37 days after member purchases premium here, which is 30 days plus the seven days before the user had access to the content. 
I'll click Save Rule and then Add New to set up my final rule for my third page. This time, I'll set the drip to be two weeks from the purchase of my premium membership and click Save Rule. Now, my last two posts will be dripped out one every week after a user purchases my premium membership. So, in the case of my site, every week when the user clicks on these page links in my menu, instead of getting the unauthorized access message, they'll have access to the individual page that has been released. For more tips on content dripping, visit our blog. Individual links are in the description. Also, head over to our knowledge base for more detail on how to set up content dripping on your site. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.